This is the Tyrannis QX7. To switch it on, long push. It's pretty bit there for a sky. Cancel the two warnings. We'll set a model up. Push the center button on the left. Choose a blank model. Go scrolling down on the scroll wheel on the right and push the center of the scroll button. Create model, push again. Loading model. Now push the page button. Takes you into the setup. Enter that with the name by pushing the center of the scroll button and type the name long push for capitals exit bottom left button scroll down near the bottom internal RF mode I've got a D8 channels 1 to 8 exit bottom left button scroll down to bind push the bind we get the noise and plug your receiver in with the bind button pushed exit bind unplug the receiver plug it back in make sure it's bound push the center button again push the page button and use the scroll button no is the page button to go through to the mixers. We need two mixers, so we'll delete those. We'll scroll down, push the center, the scroll button, and delete. Scroll down again, push the center button, scroll down, push the center, the scroll button, delete. That leaves us two channels. We're going to set up a flying wing. So we need four mixers, two on each channel. Push the center button, scroll down to insert after, exit, scroll down to channel two, insert after, and we've now got four four mixes on two channels to so we'll edit the first channel I'll we'll make that a either on one exit scroll down to Scroll down to source, push the center, move the aileron stick. Then we've got the aileron on channel one. Exit, scroll down to weight, put 70% in for the aileron movement. Exit, exit, exit. Second mixer. Edit, scroll down to source, operate the elevator, exit, wait, thirty. 30 plus 17 should give 
100% A-row movement with the stick in the corner. And repeat on channel 2. Exit. Scroll to the second mixer. Edit. Push the scroll button again. Scroll down to source. Push the center button and the scroll button. Move the elevator. Exit. Scroll down. Enter. Minus 30. Exit. Now backwards with a long push on the page button. Go down to scroll down to aileron. Push the center button of the scroll. Edit. And we'll add 30% expo exit exit and also the elevator edit scroll down to expo 30% in that exit 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 both ailerons move in the same direction assuming you've got one left hand and one right hand when we pull the pull the elevator on one moves one way and one moves the other these costs can be reversed Instead of uh, plus 70, change it to minus 70 to reverse it. And the same with the elevators. Bye.